Patients who have not just obesity, but comorbid diseases like diabetes and high blood pressure, which are more prevalent in obese patients, are more at risk of contracting the COVID-19 disease and they have worse outcomes. Part of the reason is that the way the virus enters the body are through receptors that are present both in the lung as well as the fat tissue. So the more fat tissue you have, the more entry points you have for the virus into your body. There have been countless studies that have been published now that link obesity to the risk of dying from coronavirus. When you realize that you're not only at risk for coronavirus, but you're at risk for a shorter lifespan, requirements to be on medications, limitations in your daily life. When it's come to that time, it's time to seek consultation for bariatric surgery. The benefits of bariatric surgery involve, first and foremost, permanent and significant weight loss. The ability to get down to a healthy weight and stay there. But what's not as known as much is the significant improvement and often complete remission of many of these diseases. We can often reverse diabetes. And we're seeing similar reversals of high blood pressure, high cholesterol, uh, reduction of risk of cardiovascular disease, so heart attack and stroke, reduced risk of cancers, specifically colon cancer and breast cancer. We're seeing people be able to get back to work and we are definitely seeing an increased lifespan. Our program here at St. Agnes is not only based on the surgery. We have a team of a nutritionists, we have an exercise physiologist, as well as a behavioral therapist who specializes in eating disorders. This way, patients have the best chance of achieving the best results and staying there. For me personally, it's, it's a real pleasure to come to the office and see patients months and years after their surgery who are completely different looking patients and different feeling patients than they were beforehand. And there's really an amazing transformation uh, that takes place. And it's exciting for all of us who care for these patients to be part of that transition.